Rebecca, we made it. Yep. And what did you learn from following that fence? I learned that I shouldn't trust you. <laughs> Just like go my own way. Oh, that was the hardest part of the whole journey. Yes. Going up the cliff face. It wasn't really a cliff face. There were plenty of trees to catch you if you fell. Oh, wow. And pretty, plenty of branches too. They, uh. Hey, unlike that wall down in Yangana, where it's like, dear God, not like this, please. So? So, I took a video. Maybe I should stop. No. I'm trying to introduce the babies. Okay. So? So the girl is the brown one, and her name is June. I, I don't think we should name this one. Pato? What Pato? should we name? Pato? Pato it? means stop, which is like the, the protest that's going so on. Maybe they were Julia. Ju uh, June. Oh, it was June, June right? Yeah, June. Okay, I like June. Uh, this one, he's really curious. I like him. Um, uh, we he could do be based off of. He could be Jelinskis because he is gray. Jelinskis? Is yes. that gray? Well, Grandma Julie said that Jelinskis, um, that last name came from. Um, the word jealous, which is a term for gray hair. Oh, Jelinskis. Yep, and you're also um, learning it. What? Jilly. Jilly. That will probably be his nickname. Here is Mama. She needs to be milked. So last night when I called her, she came all the way to the pen, but she left her babies behind. So then this morning, I was wondering if she had given birth or not because she looked Your smaller. Finger. Yeah, I got a little owies, uh, a few owies. Oh. But, you know, I looked at her and she didn't have any blood out her backside. So I thought, well, maybe she, maybe she didn't kid. Maybe she's just getting ready, but she doesn't look as big as she should if she's going to kid still. So there you have it. She had kidded. And but she, she just was, left her baby behind her baby. on the mountain. She's like, I'm here for the food. Yeah. And then, like, she didn't even recognize that those were her babies. She was yeah. like, are you my babies? I'm not sure. I left some babies around here. Have you seen any babies? Have you seen, have you seen their babies? Yeah. I can't find them. I can hear them. Uh, are you them? I don't know. Yeah. Well, she figured it out. Fortunately, Eventually. she has not re rejected them. Either that or she was just like, you know what? I can't find my babies. I'll just accept you guys. Yeah. You, you smell right. Enough. She's looking at Muffin, thinking mm -hmm. that Muffin is probably a bad dog. Muffin, are you a good dog or are you not so good? She's a bad dog. I can't take your video when you're so close to me. So we have lots of things to work on where you have to clean up the metal and the wood that's over there. I've been picking up trash like crazy. And our roof is really not looking as great as it did when it went in. No, you, you can see our laundry station there. That's where we are washing our laundry. Mom! And hold on, this is where we're drying our laundry. Mom! And is there a dog on your poncho? Look! What do we have here? Hi, puppy. Hi. I'm a tent now. Ah! Trail. To be loved. Yeah. Yeah, we got two healthy babies. Yep, if only we could find kitten, then we would be very happy. We need to Just teach, teach these dogs this. how to be good to cats. Yeah. But the problem is there can be casualties in that process. Miss, Miss Muffin used to be in love with Garfield. Um, didn't you? Yeah. Miss Muffin, you loved Garfield so much, but maybe Kitten was not so friendly. Maybe it was like... Well, what, once they start hating each other, it's really hard to fix relations. In front of us, that's the road to Loha. If you go to the right, it just keeps going up, up, and then to Loha. And you can see our second cottage that needs a roof. Um, we're hopefully at least going to get a flat roof on to start so that we can use that space and then put a geodesic dome on on our next trip which will hopefully be to stay so that's that 
Oh, it's nice mucus, Rebecca. What yeah. do you think of our tire walkway? Isn't that lovely? I think it needs a channel on the high side so that the water won't just go uh, over it. You know my hand is covered in mucus, right? She just gave me her Maple, ball. you better go see what Twist is barking at. Maybe you need to protect us from a cat. Oh, they're so happy. Miss Maple cried when we came. She was like this whimpering crying sound. She was so happy. Muffin it's, was happy no, too. What but if it was because she was like, you came all this way just because I ate your cat? No, she had not yet eaten the cat. No, the other cat. Oh, oh. yeah. Paul. Yes, the kitten. The other kitten. Yep. The actual kitten. Yeah. You naughty dogs. We gotta make you be friends with them, okay? You have to be nice to our cats and kittens. And there's the mountain. It's very beautiful, but you can't really appreciate it with this light. All right, so I'm gonna say goodbye. And there's the new mother and her babies. That goat is pumpkin spice latte because that is her color. She looks just like she could be. And also for the honor of the trip that we had that one time, and it was our first pumpkin spice latte that we ever had. Uh huh. And so we named a goat after it. Very yummy. All right, and then here's one more view of Maple. Hi, Maple. And Muffin's off chasing the cat. Yeah. All right. You want to say goodbye?